All right. All right, and here comes the fun part. Hmm. All right. Okay, that's why they changed it, because in this game, uh, they use Y for zero-G jumps. And before we do anything else, I'm gonna grab the box. Let's see. And these red things right here, if you remember from the first chapter, they're highly explosive. Um, which means they blow up when you they get shot, but also you can throw them at stuff. Alright, and let's do our first zero G jump. Now there's no enemies first time around, I don't think. But we'll, we'll do some fighting in a moment. Before that, we put this thing in here. Exiting zero gravity. Give me some credits, damn it. Great. You got a shock pad. Combine that with the thermite at the barricade to destroy it. Shit. I can hear more coming. Moving through the vents. Stay safe, Isaac. Working on it. All right. Entering zero gravity. Where are you, bastards? How are they not able to jump on the platform? And that one didn't drop anything either. Man, these enemies are... These guys are cheap asses. Alright. Let me see what else. Okay, I have to drop some of this stuff off at the store. Whee! Zero G jumping. Uh, not a whole lot to say about zero G jumping. Uh, it's actually really cool when they introduced it and they made it so much better in the other games. It's the one element that stays really, uh, really unique to this game. Exiting zero gravity. Because I don't think I've ever seen zero uh, gravity handled as well. Not to mention it's really, really eerie in space when the, you just hear like your localized sound. Speaking of which... Alright, I don't think I can do anything with the air can still, and it's not important enough for me to take with me. Uh, just, just gonna have to leave it, I guess. Same thing for the line racks, because I don't use the line gun. Uh, makes me a little sad. Oh, shit! Well, you're dead, fucker. Sounds like the electronics are going a little wonky. 
Uh, luckily, that's not my computer. All right. What other horrors await me? Pretty sure it's more leapers. It's always fucking leapers. Ah, I knew that. Where are you? Ah. Ah. I actually didn't remember where that one came from. I just got lucky that time. I knew that first slasher was going to come out, though. Now, I believe coming up soon we have an encounter with uh, the swarm. But I could be wrong, so give me just a moment. I'm... Ugh, well, that wasted a whole clip. But yeah, those are swarmers. Incredibly weak. I mean, I could breathe on them real bad and they'd die, but... Uh, they're probably the worst thing to run into in several situations, particularly in, impos in uh, Hard or Impossible, because they... well, they're a death sentence. Ooh, how the hell did I miss this? Okay. Uh, oh yeah, this guy, I remember. Um, let me see. Uh, Harris is one of the first guys to go crazy on the, uh, on the colony. And, uh, yeah, he's actually got his own backstory. Um, you actually see him in the comic slash uh, motion comic that they put out for uh, uh, I forget what it's called I'm gonna have to look it up later but uh, it, it's it, it documents the Aegis 7 incident where the miners go insane and all that stuff it's actually really good and I recommend it um, uh, the motion comic actually does a pretty good job I mean the motion doesn't really add anything but uh, but the voice acting is fairly good some of the dialogue's a little meh, but... Let's see... Huh, I could have swore we'd encounter something. And back to this horribly dirty area. And uh, my inventory is still full, so I need to do something about that. Now, luckily, the pulse rounds are automatically deposited. Large med pack, I'm going to move that because I may, might need that later. I'm going to sell the gold semiconductor. And I'm going to move a good majority of the plasma ammo over to my safe to store it for later. And I'm gonna take the medium med pack with me just in case. Gonna save the game. And we're going to use thermite in an enclosed oxygen uh, oxygen dominated area because that's a smart thing to do. What's even worse is the thermite's effect and how weak it is.
Yeah, if that actually happened, Isaac would be complete ash right now. That that really does irk me. Okay, you're through. Should be clear from there to the morgue. Remember, the codes are on the captain's body. Yep. This is Senior Medical Officer Nicole Brennan transmitting ship wide. We need more help. We don't have the resources to deal with this many cases. Nobody would tell us what's happening. These wounds. We are not equipped to deal with this. God. Get him to the table. Hold him. Not if you hold him down. Christ. Every corner. That was Nicole, right? I can't tell from here when that log was made. I'm sure she's around here somewhere. Alright, and after that bit of exposition, uh, this particular hole right here, uh, you will see this again. It doesn't mean anything in this chapter, but yeah, it will. I believe it's in the next one. I don't remember what's beyond the store. Oh, how wonderful. Yeah, I I remember this room, but I remember it more specifically for another uh for another chapter. Let's see, sorry we are full. Yeah, this whole place reminds me of a dentist's office. It's really freaky. Yeah, I certainly remember more enemies, but again, that's from a different chapter, so I was actually expecting it to be much worse. Uh, still, I think I trigger another encounter in this room, so I'm not out of the woods yet. And these flashing lights are not doing my eyes any good. Let's see, more plasma energy. I don't know what the hell so much plasma energy is doing in this place. Alright. Yeah, I just have to grab this thing. And fire it off into the hole. Actually, can I do that? Nope. Didn't work. Well, the lights are fixed at least. Uh, yeah, this is just lovely. Dead? No, I want the ammo. Thank you. Strategic dismemberment indeed. Ugh. Those ragdoll physics are great though. I, I, I wish I had more stasis on me, or otherwise I'd play around with it. And here is another power note room. And line racks. That would be really useful to me if I were using the line gun. But lots more uh, ammunition. Lots of ammunition, actually. That's uh, I'm rolling in cash concerning that. <laughs> 